What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, 4AM Pacific, and we are back with another video. I'm just checking in. This video is just kind of, you know, just check the temperature. See how everybody's October is going. You know, it's Halloween month. And as you can see, Modern Warfare 2 has got the Halloween theme going right now. You know, I noticed, you know, you see all these little skulls, these glowing skulls when you're when you're playing team deathmatch, when you're playing hardpoint, you know, playing these different go uh these different game modes. You're able to collect these souls and you're able to turn them in or redeem them, I guess, and you know, and get and get little items, get little prizes. As you can see right here, man, I I, I got a couple things, you know, I I purchased our redeemed, you know, an emblem. I also redeemed some like XP, I think some weapon XP. I also picked up this this pistol that was available. I liked how it looks, man. I can't even lie to you. It's called the Alien Death Ray. I have not used it yet. I have not equipped it yet. I actually just equipped it. So the next video you see of some gameplay, you will see this being used and me popping off with it but let's get to the topic of this video yeah man so what i've noticed with modern warfare 2 after playing modern warfare 3 it does seem like it's a little bit slower i can't even lie man i've kind of enjoyed modern warfare 2 a little bit more after coming back from modern warfare 3 it's, it's like it's like things have slowed down for me you know, when I was playing the Modern Warfare 3 open beta, man, that thing, it was just so fast, so quick, you know. And plus, the skill-based matchmaking was just insane, man. It was crazy. It was crazy. And I thought Modern Warfare 2's skill-based matchmaking was crazy, man. Nah, man, Modern Warfare 3 skill-based matchmaking is on a whole different level. And anybody who has played it knows what I'm talking about. So... You know, I came back to Modern Warfare 2 because, you know, the beta has closed. I still got a whole bunch of Modern Warfare 3 gameplay, though. You know, I still got a whole bunch of gameplay from Modern Warfare 3 that I still need to edit, you know, and get out to y'all. I just haven't done it yet. I want to kind of break it up. I want to slowly drop some Modern Warfare 3, you know, gameplay as we're waiting for the full release of the game. And I got a whole, you know, plan rollout of what I'm going to do. Leading up to when Modern Warfare 3 actually drops. So stay tuned for that. And I promise you it'll be worth the wait. But let's get back to the topic, man. Modern Warfare 2. I ain't gonna lie. When I came back to Modern Warfare 2 after Modern Warfare 3, what I did notice was I was just getting, <laughs> like, I was getting slammed, man. I was getting ridiculous, like just timing, uh, the recoil was throwing me off. So it took me a couple games to get back in the flow of things. Uh, this gameplay, I think this was like my third game playing after coming back from Modern Warfare 3. And I dropped about 62 kills in this game. So, yeah, it, it, it took about a couple games. Anybody who did play the beta and went back to Modern Warfare 2 knows what I'm talking about, man. Like, th the games do feel different. I was sli trying to slide cancel in Modern Warfare 2. I was, I, was, I was just getting killed trying to slide cancel, you know? So things like that took some getting used to. But as I said before, it the game, when you come from Modern Warfare 3 to Modern Warfare 2, it does seem like it is a bit slower. And it actually helped me out playing Modern Warfare 3 because I was so focused and I, my reaction time had to be so, you know, so quick and so fast that when I came to Modern Warfare 2, it felt like I was playing a bunch of people who weren't playing the MW3 beta. So their reaction times didn't have to be that fast, you know? So when I came back to Modern Warfare 2 and I would start playing, and I got to this third game and I stopped like slide canceling and I stopped doing certain things that I was doing in Modern Warfare 3, man, it just seemed like they couldn't mess with my reaction time, you know, based on me being used to playing the beta. So yeah, what did you guys think about Modern Warfare 3? Or, matter of fact, better question. Has your opinion of Modern Warfare 2 changed? Like, now that you came back from Modern Warfare 3? I know, I know I've know, i seen those opinions out there. I've seen people, like, just yelling that they think Modern Warfare 2 is a whole better game, period. Than what Modern Warfare 3 is even going to be. 
like i've had i've seen i've seen tiktoks i've seen i've seen shorts i've seen videos on youtube of people saying that they really enjoy modern warfare 2 better than modern warfare 3 and that and that call of duty is going backwards with modern warfare 3 that's not exactly my opinion like i i do see some you know i do see some progress with mw3 but it's that 70 dollar price tag right that 70 dollar price tag like does it warrant that 70 dollar price tag the changes they did make eh, i don't know like because in my opinion i just feel like to be honest with you i'm gonna I'm give you a teaser what the, my, my my modern warfare 3 review video is actually gonna you know be based on it's gonna be me basically saying that modern warfare 3 is is just what modern warfare 2 should have felt like what it should have been you know they, they're just adding things in the game that should have never left the game there's not there's not there's not a lot of real new things happening in modern warfare 3 that that makes you you know feel good paying 70 dollars for it that's just, that's just my honest opinion but you know, a lot of people have different opinions in mind. I can't, you know, I can't knock you for your opinion. Your opinion is your opinion. My opinion is not right. You know, my opinion is my opinion. All I do know is that, you know, when I came back from Modern Warfare 3 and came back to Modern Warfare 2, I did notice the difference, you know. I actually did I actually could appreciate the little little bit slower pace of modern warfare 2 coming back from modern warfare 3 it's like i was able to think you know i was able to slow it down a little bit make make better decisions because the game is a, that much it's not a lot but it is that much slower in modern warfare 2 right now you know you can see they got the halloween thing going crazy i, I noticed that a lot of people have been playing and messing around with the you know battle royale uh, it's like the haunted battle royale so i plan i do plan to do some gameplay of that i don't usually play battle royale um uh, battle royale type games is not really my thing man i hate i hate that you die and then it you got to go through the whole process all over again it, it, i hate that one and done type of you know game style but I've, I have been practicing some battle royale and I've been doing okay, but I know that skill based matchmaking is probably going to kick in soon and I won't do as well as I've been doing. So I am going to try to get some battle royale gameplay going, you know, before that skill based matchmaking, you know, kicks in because it, it always when it kicks in for me, man, it 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 kicks in to the point I can't move on the map. <laughs> I can't move on the map. So I'm going to try to get that going for y'all, especially since it is October. I do want to get some of that, you know, that Halloween Modern Warfare 2 actual gameplay, you know, uh, going. Especially with the on the maps where the maps, you know, just look completely different. They they have like the blood writing on the wall and it's, it's the maps are darker, grimmier, grimier, you know, haunted feeling. So I want to get those going, especially once it once it gets once it gets closer to Halloween, we gon' we gonna get it we gonna get it going for y'all, I promise you. But yeah, man, like I said before, this video is really just to check in with you. Check the temperature, see how your October is going. If y'all got any plans, make sure you drop what y'all plan on doing in the comment section. Make sure whatever you guys are doing out there, you being safe, being smart. Don't go to jail. If you're old enough to be out there drinking and stuff, don't go to jail, man. You don't want to be in jail dressed as Fred Flintstone, bro. You don't want to do it. Dang, we lost that, too. I forgot we lost that game. It's all good. It's all good. It's all good. It's all about the kills. I got 62. I got 62. See? 62. <laughs> but yeah, man. That's the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Make sure you like, comment, share, subscribe. Tell a friend. And until next time. Yeet.